the den of doom. Where are we going, Baloo? Mowgli asked. He and Baloo had been traveling through the jungle for a while now. Have you ever heard of the den of doom, man cub? Replied Baloo in a hushed voice. Oh, we got the den of doom. They say that the den of doom is a giant cave filled with bears who will eat anything or anyone. They say that even Shere Khan is afraid of them, he explained. Mm-hmm, said Baloo. They do say that. They also say that all the bears in the den of doom are over eight feet tall and their teeth are green and razor sharp, and that their battle cry is so loud that the whales in the ocean hear it and shake with fright. And we're going there, while we squeak? We can't. Too late, man cub, Baloo said with a grin. We're already here. He picked Mowgli up and strode right into a thicket. The boy looked around in surprise. Mowgli had expected to see tons of fierce, angry bears. Instead, he saw hundreds of relaxed, happy bears having a really good time. Bears were swimming in a small pond, splashing and laughing. Bears were resting in the shadows of the cave. Bears were playing tag out in the clearing, chomping on piles of ripe, delicious fruit. It was, in short, a bear party. I don't understand, Mowgli said to Blue. This is the den of doom? Yep, Blue said happily, grabbing a palm frond and fanning himself with it. It used to be called the den of delight, but we had to change the name. See, everyone in the jungle knew that the den of delight was the most fun place around. The bears never turned anyone away from our party, but then it got so crowded that it was just wasn't fun anymore. We spread a few rumors, changed the name, and presto, it's the Den of Doom. Now, no one bothers us bears anymore. What about me? Mowgli said anxiously. I'm not a bear. You're an honorary bear, Mowgli. Mowgli replied with a smile. You sure have enough fun to be one. Love you. Night.